this is the uh, this is the bar, the piano-shaped bar off the pool area, and on either side of the bar are cabanas and dressing rooms, and the pool. We're actually looking at the uh, back end of the house. It's very difficult to uh, photograph the front of the house because it's on a very steep hill, and it's only been photographed once from the front from a helicopter. And I didn't have one handy for you today, so we're seeing it from the back, from the pool area. This home, which is in Hollywood, by the way, is only a couple of minutes from Sunset Boulevard, which is one of the main thoroughfares. And yet it has amazing privacy. Everyone who visits me are constantly amazed that we have uh, outdoor carpeting everywhere. Uh, we have the thick kind of carpeting and the green kind of turf carpeting. And uh, this is the uh, newest addition to the house. This room here was uh, once an open veranda. And I used to bring my guests out here to look at the wonderful view of Hollywood. And then I decided to enclose it as a porch. And uh, I got a little carried away because then I went from screens to windows, and, and then I had the Italian tile floor put in, and it turned out to be a room rather than a porch. And uh, uh, I decided this would be a good place to have a nice bar. And we don't just use it as a bar, but we also use it for late night entertainment, for late after theater suppers and that sort of thing. This is an iron fireplace, and uh, this used to be a plain wall here. And I opened up the fireplace that leads into the living room, so we have a two-way fireplace here. And these are Strauss crystals from Bavaria. And my most prized possession are a pair of candelabras that came from uh, Ludwig of Bavaria's castle. They are blue opaline glass and ormolu bronze, and they're museum pieces. I've given some wonderful parties out here, and after the sun goes down, it's inclined to get a bit chilly, so we have outdoor heaters to heat the atmosphere. They're hidden in the trees, so they're not noticeable. But uh, I can actually warm this entire outdoor area to uh, about 70 degrees, which is very comfortable. Over here we have a barbecue, complete with candelabra and piano keys. And this is the barbecue area. This is my bedroom, how do you like it? It's French Victorian and most of the furnishings are antique. The cabinets are French Boule, designed by André Boule early in the 18th century. The bed is a combination of antique and uh, carvings done by a Spanish artisan that I discovered right here in Los Angeles. And I combined his carvings with the antique pieces that I found in an antique shop in my rummaging around. And the bedspread is white llama fur and uh, ermine. This is the master bath with twin sinks. They call them his and hers, but since I'm a bachelor, I use them both myself. On the walls of this stairway are some of the cartoons and awards and presentations that commemorate my 30 years in show business. Uh, this was given to me by the County of Los Angeles to commemorate my silver anniversary in show business five years ago. And amongst other things, they said I put the word glamour back into show business. I've been cartooned all over the world by some marvelous cartoonists with great imagination. This one appeared in London. They likened me to Sir Ernest Macmillan there. And to our left, some awards to commemorate Columbia Records, the sale of over 100,000 albums. Each one of these represent 100,000 albums. And a kind of a marvelous award from the piano technicians who are sort of the unsung heroes of the piano world the men who tune the pianos and keep them in top shape. 
deemed me the man who had done the most to promote interest in piano music during the year 1953. It's cartoons like this suggesting that I run for the United States Senate that give people the idea that I may have political aspirations. I don't. I send Christmas greetings to the President of the United States every year, and each year they send me an acknowledgement of the Christmas uh, present. This one acknowledges my cookbook that I sent the President. He said, uh, this is when Lynn, uh, Lyndon Johnson was present, he said, uh, we have your copy of Liberace Cooks. Mrs. Johnson joins me in thanking you for your thoughtfulness in sending us